Yo, what's going on guys? My name is the Pro Bartlett. Welcome back to a brand new video. This is some more Black Ops 3 uh, beta gameplay. Using the Razorback, it's an SMG. Uh, this is before the Razorback got patched. <coughs> Excuse me. I think they added more they added more recoil to the um, to the gun, I believe. But um, it was really, really strong before the before they patched it. I don't know if they actually patched it. That's that's just what I saw on Twitter. I saw good old David Bondahar. He said he patched the gun, so I, I don't know. As soon as I saw that, I didn't even use it again. Well, I used it once, and it was like, eh. So, I had quick draw and stock on the gun. I know what you're thinking. Why would you put stock on SMG? For the Razorback, it was really good. I tried stock on some of the other SMGs, um, and really... It was really good on the CUDA and the Razorback. The other, the other SMGs, it wasn't very good on. But I feel like the CUDA, I think that's, I think that's called the CUDA, but the CUDA and the Razorback, uh, they don't have much sway to them, at least in my opinion. So I, I, I threw stock on them. It worked really well. So uh, as far as the perks, I was using, I think I was using Afterburner again. I was using Fast Hands. I did have Anti up on. And let me tell you about anti up because this actually makes me kind of mad. I was um, I was kind of ranting about this yesterday, but anti up basically is a extremely extremely watered down hardline. And when I mean watered down, I'm talking about like you know how your mom, you know, when you were a kid, she'd make you some Kool Aid, and she only put one tablespoon of sugar in. Yeah, yeah, that's that kind. That's that kind of watered down. You take a drink and you're like. You know, this also this bitter and sour. Yeah, that is how anti up is. Anti up, it's a green perk. It's your second perk, and or your second tier perk rather. And when you start, this is the only ability it has. When you start the game, when you spawn in, it gives you like I think I think it's fifty or seventy five points towards your uh, your score streak. That sucks, you know, Hardline, you know, I'll admit Hardline, I guess, I guess I really wanted to try to not make it to where people would spam score streaks, because in Black Ops 2, Hardline was really, really, really good. Black Ops 1, not so much, you know, Black Ops 1, it just gave you a, a kill that was less, you know, like one less off your score streak, but I think they should have still put it in, like, they could have put, they could have put Black Ops 1 hardline in the game. I think it'd be fine if, if that was the only um that was the only uh um its ability was just knock a you know knock a hundred points off your score streak. But um you know it's not in it. I got anti up anti up I don't it, it sucks. I, I unless there's some hidden ability in there or unless they change it that I just don't know about it just freaking sucks. But uh yeah I don't like anti up and then for the last perks, I was using um, Gung Ho and Blast Suppressor. But um, this is some more TDM. I didn't really do very well at this game, but there was a reason why I decided to save this gameplay. So there, so there must be some really good gun exchanges, some good uh, gun on gun uh, battles I, I don't know i don't know why i saved this to be honest i didn't watch it and was like oh yeah i remember why i saved it i probably wanted to show off like everything that you could do in the game because in the beginning of the video i was swimming and that's really cool i'm pretty sure i killed some people while i was swimming so there's a lot of really cool features to the beta but as you guys know the beta it is it's done with it's done over with and we won't be able to play this game again until November 6th, I believe, is when it comes out. Which I'm really looking forward to it because there's going to be a lot of changes, you know. Obviously, there is guns and kill streaks that we did not get to see in the beta. They were, you know, classified. We weren't able to use Gunsmith, um, which I believe Gunsmith is where you can, like, make your own guns. Because from what I heard, you could put six attachments on a gun, but you couldn't do it in the beta. The most you could have is three. So, well, actually, you could have. Well, I guess you could have had five perks, couldn't you? I don't know. I couldn't do it. Like it wouldn't let me do it. Period. I didn't, maybe I didn't unlock the things you needed for it. I don't know. 
I don't really know what Gunsmith is, uh, but you couldn't use it in the beta, so. Uh, we'll be able to see that. And there's going to be more patches and nerfs, and hopefully some buffs. Like, anti up means a buff, I'm telling you guys. I'm telling you guys, you need like half a bag of sugar in that Kool-Aid. So, you need at least, you know, half a bag of sugar in that anti up. But, that's really all I got to say. I was using the, I think it's called the Sparrow, which is the bow and arrow. Um, specialist. That's really good. It's one of my favorites just because I probably don't do it in this gameplay, but most of the time when I pull this bad boy out, I'll get four, five, six kills with it. Just chunking my arrow at them. And look at that guy. He thought he thought he was so slick just sitting there. But um, I usually get four or five kills with the bow, and I really like it, but it's not very good. It's only good on like to the maps in the beta, so at least that we play. There's only there's only four maps total, and it's probably a lot better to have something like glitch or rejack because there's always going to be situations where you just don't, you just can't pull it out because you either are running around, you can't find any enemies, so you've already wasted your specialist, or <clears throat> um, you're like the range is just too far. At least with the Sparrow. The Sparrow doesn't go too far. It only goes like short to medium range. I mean, there's probably all other ones that go a lot farther. Like the uh, that laser cannon. Laser rifle looking thing. But I I found myself always pulling the Sparrow out. And just not being able to kill anybody. So I'm having to save it. In order, you know, when I see you know, people close to me on the minimap. I pull it out. And I feel like I'm not getting the best... Um, the most use out of Sparrow or any any of the kill streak or excuse me any of the ones that pull out a weapon and kill you I feel like you know rejack and glitch are better maybe even kinetic armor I don't know I didn't use kinetic armor I used uh, I think it's called overdrive I could be wrong but it's the one that like speeds you up it gives you like super human speed for like I don't know like five seven seconds that one's not too good either. Like, it, it will be. I mean, if you play Capture the Flag, it's really good. You play Hardpoint, it's really good. But overall, you're just running to your death, I feel like. so. But even then, I think that's probably a little bit better than the Sparrow and the the other ones. Um, as far as the kill streaks, get the UAV on. Get the Hillstorm and the, uh, I don't know what it's called, the Patrol Unit, something like that. Those are all really good kill streaks. Like the Hellstorm missile is the new lightning strike. I feel like lightning strike is in the game. I uh, didn't get to unlock it and use it, so I'm not sure how well it plays. But I, for the most part, I haven't seen anybody uh, use the lightning strike. Like even people who hit level 40 and had everything unlocked, you know, people were still using the Hellstorm missile, and it's good. Like I don't, I don't. I mean, it's just good. <laughs> like it does exactly what the lightning strike does. I get, you know triples and quad feeds with it all the time so but anyway guys that's it for the gameplay gameplay is coming to an end i didn't do very well but for whatever reason i decided to upload this i'm sure there was some pretty cool um stuff in the video i don't know i wasn't even really paying attention to half of it i was looking outside my window thinking man what a pretty day it is but anyway guys hope you guys enjoyed we lost that will happen a lot and uh yeah if you could give this video a like if you enjoyed the commentary please subscribe to the channel this channel is very new i would like to hit 10 subscribers that's my subscriber goal so um you can follow me on twitter link will be in the description below and i hope you guys have a great day and i will see you guys in the next video peace